Hey, Monster Truck fans, and welcome to another episode of TMB TV. It's been a great season, 2009. It's October. We're getting down to the end of the year, but that doesn't mean the shows are over because we've got one of our biggest episodes of the year coming up right now. We are in Montreal, the first time that the main staff of the MonsterBlog.com has ever covered an event up here, and we have the biggest promoter in Monster Trucks in Canada, and that's Chris Arell Motorsports. This is their biggest event, Montreal Olympic Stadium, 13 monster trucks. 12 of them are going to go racing in freestyle, and we've got Larry Quick with the Ghost Rider here. 2009's been a very special year in monster trucks with a new backflip coming out, and Larry's going to be trying to do that here in front of over 40,000 fans. We've got Bounty Hunter with Jimmy Creighton, one of the winningest drivers of the year. Rick Long with Bigfoot. The four team Scream Trucks. Dan Patrick with Samson. It's going to be an incredible night. So here it comes, fans. Get ready for racing in freestyle. C'est le moment de regarder TMB TV sur la Monster Blog. Êtes-vous prêts? Well, fans, we told you in the opener, we're incredibly excited to be here in Montreal, Olympic Stadium. And right now, we got the man that makes all of this happen up here in Canada, Chris Arell. First time on the Monster Blog. We've never gotten a chance to cover one of your events. It's an incredible opportunity. Uh, give us a little history about Chris Arell Motorsports and bringing monster trucks up to Canada. Well, first of all, welcome to Montreal, to the whole uh, Monster Blog team. Uh, we started putting shows in Canada back in 86 uh, in mostly hockey arenas. Uh, my dad build, built Canada's first monster trucks back in 83, was called Superfoot. And at one point we had up to five trucks and we were touring across Canada, mostly in arenas. And uh, back in uh, 90, I bought Weapon One truck and I ran that truck till 93. Uh, and I've been producing shows since 86. We started very small in small hockey arenas on concrete. We're actually the very first promoters to do uh, shows on concrete back in the 80s. And uh, it grew bigger, uh, bigger venues, and of course this one here in Montreal is Canada's biggest monster truck event. 13 monster trucks, 45,000 spectators twice a year, uh, early in the spring and in the fall, so it's a big show every year. Definitely, and you've, you have pulled out all the stops for this one. you got 12 trucks, some of the biggest names in the sport up here doing racing and freestyle, and as if all that wasn't enough, first time the backflip's going to be done in a big stadium. Exactly. The core of the show is always monster trucks. Uh, the racing, we always have some new designs of racing tracks every year. Freestyle obstacles are huge. But we got to bring some new stuff every year, and that's what we're doing. And a lot of people say, how, how do you do it twice a year? You know, 40, 45,000 people at the Montreal Olympic Stadium. In some years, we had up to 55,000. I mean, it's just to bring some new stuff, uh, bring first quality trucks, and that's what we uh, basically do in every year. For us, the most important thing is uh, uh, the quality of the show and nonstop action. I mean, I've seen. Uh, Many shows out there where you see long delays, we don't love that. We love to see stuff that are bang, 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 nonstop. Well, very good. Autocross, backflip, monster trucks. You know, we haven't been up here at Olympic Stadium before, so you have a better idea what to expect from all these guys. Give us some predictions for tonight. Well, there's going to be some racing will be very exciting in the monster trucks. I mean, Bigfoot won here four years. Uh, Bonnie Honor won, won six times, so it's going to be a big challenge. And we have some newcomers, you know, like Avenger and guys like that that are every year finishing second, third, they want a victory. As far as freestyle, it's hard to tell what's going to happen, but definitely there's going to be a lot of uh, rollovers and crashes. Uh, autocross, we have the series this year. It's Quebec versus Ontario. It's going to be a great challenge, you know, the, between the two provinces. And the demo derby at the end is always spectacular. So three hours of nonstop action. Well, you can't ask for more than that. Now, real quick, Chris, 2010, I'm sure you got some big stuff in store. Uh, the tour is going to be going on. How can fans find out all that info about your tour for next year? We'll be releasing the dates uh, for 2010 in about two weeks on our site, www.monsterspectacular.com. We're looking at about possibly 25 shows coast to coast in Canada and a couple of U.S. stops. Well, that's the man, Chris Arell, Chris Arell Motorsports. The Monster Spectacular is coming up here later tonight at Olympic Stadium. And, uh, man, Chris, we're excited, and we can't thank you enough for bringing us out here. Thanks for coming. We'll have some fun tonight. 
Well, fans with TMB TV, we're always looking for something new and exciting. And what could be more exciting than putting a camera inside a stack for freestyle? You know, a couple episodes back in Lawton, Oklahoma, we introduced the TMB TV track cam. We put it right down in the rodeo gates, and you saw some wild footage as the trucks came right over and did donuts right in front of our camera. So with this old camera, you know what? If it gets smashed, oh well. So what we've done is we've attached it right up here into the bread van as part of this huge stack and as the trucks come up to this stack hit it and go up and over it we're going to have the best seat in the house for that with the tmb tv track cam and that's going to be part of our coverage tonight so keep an eye on that well fans we just showed you the throwaway camera you could almost call it our tmb tv track cam inside the bread van as part of the freestyle stack but here with this the golden opportunity the monster truck backflip we're using every camera angle we have at our disposal for it and you saw right there at the top of the hill we've got a camera pointed looking down you're going to see the entire rotation and it's going to be one of the coolest shots you've seen so far of a monster truck backflip and that's all part of the tmb tv track cams we've got two of them tonight and we're ready to go